NBC 10 News at 5 continues. After news of the first ULM student testing positive from COVID-19, we went to see what the campus is like. And for what it is usually a busy university, it has turned into a ghost town. NBC 10's Maya Hudgens talked to a senior at ULM who says how it's been coping with this entire ordeal. Saturday, the University of Louisiana at Monroe confirmed one of its students tested positive for COVID-19. If I'm being honest, it was kind of expected. I know a lot of people are not necessarily taking it very seriously. The campus is now closed to the general public and only students with permission are allowed to stay. For senior Elizabeth Williams, this is a weird situation she never saw coming in her five years at ULM. Even just walking outside, I noticed there's no one around, so we're used to parking being pretty pretty packed and so not having anyone around is is definitely an adjustment. Despite the new normal, Williams says she will be staying on campus as it was easier than packing up and going home. She says she still hopes she can walk across the graduation stage on May 16th. You always look forward to walking at least for uh, college. You know, high school is one thing, but your degree is another. Williams says she's not worried about the virus spreading to her dorm because she's following all the mandated rules, like washing your hands, social distancing, and staying put. They did tell us that, you know, the appropriate people will be notified if they were in that residence hall or not. So we're just kind of waiting to see if they're anywhere near us, I guess. In Monroe, Maya Hudgens, NBC 10, your local news leader.